Anthony in New York, he knows a little something about uh, Charles Manson. How do you know oh. something about Charles Manson? All right, well, first off, hey, what's up, guys? First off, I got a good friend who was, uh, who was in the military who did a tour in Iraq in 2003. So when uh, he got back, he told me, well, as everybody knows, Charles Manson, you know, he's, he's still alive. He uh, avoided the, uh, uh, the death penalty, and, uh, you know, I, I forget it. And, like, the 70s or something, because there was a certain clause... It was a rule in California. Yeah, we know. We, they, yeah. They, they repealed the death penalty. They, they, yeah, and he simple got as that. Okay, continue. They were going to kill him, and then, yeah. <laughs> yeah. He got okay. lucky. Here's the deal. <laughs> None of y'all would think this is crazy. This is true, though. Right before we went to Iraq in 2003, they came to him. The CIA has, has started, like, um, uh, operation, and they wanted to use, use him in Iraq. He had the opportunity to be free. And they came to him and said, you know, here's what we want you to do. That's... We want you to go to Iraq and act as one of them and, you know, I guess have him dress up in the clothes or whatever and act as, like, an ambassador and try and get uh, out, out Hussein. And they wanted to use him to talk to the people because, you know, he's a very smart man. He's got a crazy high IQ, and he speaks, he speaks a lot of languages. They wanted to use him over there. Opie, did you get <laughs> did you get that baby carry thing as a gift, or did you have to buy it? It's a true story. Did you get it as a gift or have to buy it? A guy that's a gift with his swastika cut in his head. They all wanted to use him over there. They are yeah, because because he's stable and he would do exactly what the government wants of him. We're not going to do it. Got to turn off that awful music and play Helter Skelter. Do we, we, want you to do we just hang up on him? What do we do? Are you out of your fucking <laughs> mind? Wait a minute, wait. Listen, you know I'm a conspiracy theorist. Uh -huh. It's very interesting uh -huh. that he's saying this. I mean, it's possible, but it's a lot of... For, I mean, what is he, he goes over there and they tell him to pretend he's an Arab with that, with that fucking voice he got? Yeah, what, what? They wanted to pretend he was an Arab and they wanted to, to speak to all the Arab people in his language and get them to move or travel or... I'm going to be, I'm gonna be honest, man. Them. Guys with this accent, Iraq, never, Iraq, I never Iraq, seem Iraq. to think they're they did, crazy. They had a covered plan, I promise. I swear to God. I don't know if it's on, on documents because the whole thing was scrapped, but I got a good friend in the military. He's, a, he's, a, he's not a conspiracy theorist. But he's he told me good that friend. He says that, that would come out. This is the reason. This is the reason I. I fucking believe it. This is the reason I don't. I don't believe in. Uh, I don't believe in UFOs. Yeah. I, I, I don't believe in anything. Like uh, I believe in government shit to a to a, to a degree, to a, yeah, yeah. A, a large degree. But a lot of a lot of this shit you can't hide. Like you hear he's saying a friend of mine yeah, said this said Charles Man the Charles Manson plan. Now the, that's a low level conspiracy thing is Charles. Man so at this point, this is why you know I I have I'm having trouble with JFK and a lot of that stuff because there's somebody what is is sense. gonna say something? No one can keep alien secret. No one can even keep Operation Fucking Charlie Manson. By the way, Operation Charlie Manson. I like Operation that. Charlie Manson has to be Charlie the Manson. dumbest fucking thing. Oh no I've no ever no, heard. Anthony, hold on a second. You're there? Yeah yeah. All right, hold on. David in Oklahoma wants in on this one. David. Yeah, the, I think that guy's been listening to Alex Jones a little too much. I mean, that's the dumbest fucking thing I've ever heard. Yeah, yeah. It's the dumbest thing. But guess what? But guess what? It, it's, the, it's the type of stuff that people like you say is the dumbest thing I've ever heard, which is why they do shit and get away with it, because regular people like you think, uh, nah, it won't happen, God, it won't happen. All right. well, who, who's your buddy in the Army? Is he some low-level private that thinks he knows everything? He's got the inside <laughs> scoop on nothing? <laughs> No, no, he, he drops on people nothing. like you every day. In the is, your, is your buddy the chef at some barracks in the middle of the desert? Is that where you're getting this info from? I mean, that'll do. Go get some stuff. That's the most ludicrous fucking thing, dude. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> you know what though? Is, is there is there the any is there any place you can send anybody that has this anywhere? That that's the thing. When you say my buddy told me, that's where it gets fucked up. But you got to have a place to, to like Alex Jones, man. He'll Why is your, they, they always have a place to send you. Uh, you know the yeah. guys, the, the guys that. Yeah. Do, yeah. By the way, the guys that have. Ah! The guys that, right. we got two guys arguing on the phone. Right, hold on, I'll, I'll fade them down a minute. The guys that have that info yeah. aren't going to tell their buddies. No. That's that's how the CIA works. They don't, yeah. they don't have fucking guys just going, oh, my God, i got to tell my buddies buddy? back home. 
Hey, who is your buddy? Yeah, who's your buddy, Anthony? Who's your, and, and, and trust me, man. Who, who's you know, your buddy? Those posts and those bass and those guys <laughs> Would you listen to me for a second? Post. Who's your buddy? What does he do? <laughs> what's your buddy's... <laughs> hey, 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 dude, dude. Hey, hey, Anthony. What does your buddy do? Like, what, what uh, line of the military is he in that he even was privy to this information? He uh, schemes on people's... Uh, he pulls up IP addresses on regular people like you and me. He listens to our conversations. He, uh, if he gets a flag, like if, if you're texting a buddy, I had a, f yeah. I had a fucking buddy that told me that, man. This is hey, listen, listen, people listen to you. So they listen to me. Uh, what during my phone calls and shit? I mean, not you know, it's just every, it's Operation Big Brother. You heard of that, right? They do listen no, to you call some, for buzzwords it. like fuck the president and I'm going to blow up this and that I shit. I read about Big Brother in 1984. Yeah, that's like 1984 all over again. Yeah, yeah. All yeah. Right. All right, David, thank you. Let me go to, uh, shit, hold on a minute. Sorry about that. Let me go to Cassius in Brooklyn. Cassius, Cassius. you're on with Anthony in New York. <laughs> oh, thank God. Yeah, he's, he's so uh, so brilliant. Uh, this is, it's just such the most ridiculous story. Uh, Manson is not multilingual. He doesn't. He doesn't know anything other than English. He That's what I'm saying. How do you know? How do you and, know? And he's world like know? people know what he looks like. <laughs> Prove it. But yeah, he's got he's got a swastika carved into his forehead. <laughs> <laughs> and a guy like that to do diplomatic work. Or, or you, this is so asinine. So fucking be very asinine, which is why they do something like that. Expect people like you not to believe it. Come Could on. Could you like, imagine if that ever got out? <laughs> Like that the president was using Charles Manson was behind Charles Manson. Bunch of Arabs around a campfire. He fucking, yeah. He'll have some Arabs going to kill us. If it gets out, how are we going to look? Of course he said no. But the CIA, was, the CIA was working on this about a couple of months before Operation, or whatever, in 2003, yep. right before we went to Iraq. You know what, Cassius? He makes a good point. What do you got on that? Jeez. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's su such a solid point, yeah. yeah. I mean, you, you, can say, you can say this about anyone. You could say they were trying to let any, any, anybody out of prison to, to do something like this, and, and then you just say, you know, it's, it's because common people like, like us wouldn't believe it, that that's why they would do it. It's yeah, so anything ridiculous, ridiculous is viable because we oh, wouldn't Anthony, believe it? Is, is that it? Wait, Anthony's got a question. Go, Anthony. Hi, Cassius, you remember the Iceman, right? The Iceman? The Iceman from New Jersey, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He over 100 people. He killed them in all these sick ways. He, he, uh, he ice picked them, stabbed them, he shot them. All right, all right whatever. Go forward. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you don't remember man. Do your mafia history. All right, man, why do you think he's still alive? Let me ask you that. Oh, well, good question. Okay. He's why got you there, Cassius. Alive? Yeah. What, is this a person who's locked up currently? Yeah. I mean, he's locked up. He, he, he does a fucking uh, interview on Dateline every year. It's like an anniversary thing. And the media gets a fucking kick off this guy, man. They get a hard on off this dude because he's such a fucking genius. They won't kill him. Well, there's, all sorts of, there's all sorts of criminals we have locked up. Aren't, <laughs> that aren't death, being I mean, killed? What, what does that prove? That proves nothing. It proves a lot, man. You gotta wake up. All right, man. right on, Cassius. Thank you. Wow. You know, thank you to Cat. But I'm telling you. All right, hold on, hold on, Anthony. Half of the shit that All right. I'm trying to tell you, but y'all don't want to. Anthony, breathe. shut the fuck up for a second. Shut up. Shut up. Wait, he might, he might say something good here. The thing. Y'all look crazy not to give that any kind of weight. Come on. All right, listen. Come on. You don't think we were A lot of people do, though. Hold on. A Anthony, I'm trying to shut you up because I got a guy backing you up. We got Dana in Boston. You're on with Anthony in New York. Boys, good morning. Can you hear me? Yes, yeah. I got you, Dana. What up, I want to let uh, you guys know that uh, my brother's in the Air Force. Yep. And uh, he heard that they're going to hire Jeffrey Dahmer to go to Area 51 and talk to the aliens. <laughs> Fucking John Travolta sound a retard. <laughs> Anthony, comment. He called you a John Travolta sounding retard. retard. Hey, what was his name? His name uh, was Dana. 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 Hey, Dana. Hey, fuck you and the Boston Red Sox and your fucking bitch-ass name, bitch-ass nigga. Dana. Oh, What's damn. My name is Dana. Sick to be calling from Boston. I'm sorry about that, Patrice, man. You cool, though, but, you know, fuck Dana. Well, you didn't have to use the N-word. Well, Patrice isn't a bitch ass. Yeah, really. And he, he used it in the correct context. It's yeah, a motion behind it. You can't worry about well, it. What are you going to do? Uh, Anthony, uh, Derek in Alabama. Derek, you're on with Anthony in New York. Hey, yeah, why would uh, they send him over to Iraq to listen to our phone calls? Can't they just do that from here? 
No, they're doing that from here, but Yeah, that the He has a point though, you can't just dismiss him. It's possible. You can completely maybe dismiss Opera this guy. Get the hell out of here, Ma Maybe Operation Charles Manson could yeah. be with someone else, though. Because yeah. people say this a lot. They say this a lot. Why are you wasting regular lives when, and, and filling up these jails? There's two million people in jail, some shit. And it's like, why not send a couple of them over? And they might be looking into that, giving these guys choice. They do it. They do it on these shows it's where they the give dirty you, <clears throat> mm. but they give these kids a choice. You go to jail for the rest of your life, or you go to this boot camp. The they, I'm sure there's some prisoners, right? They go, okay, we're gonna transfer. You, you seen uh, Con Air? You go, yeah, I'm gonna transfer these sick motherfuckers to this prison we just built. Yeah. All right. Don't have a family. The guys been in jail ten years. Fucking no, no visitors. They go, listen, we got, we, listen, you, you could, you could do this for us. Go into this training, this clockwork orange kind of shit, and we're gonna send you over to Iraq and do some some clandestine work. It's it's you can't dismiss you you can't just say fuck that because he's right. The point is you, you can't just Charles go. Charles Manson thing. I agree with the possibility of things that happen I that we can't. don't believe that they can uh, right. exist. The, uh, uh, Scandal. It's funny that, that he says out. Charles Manson. Charles Manson is just a funny guy. To say, but he's if he said this, seventy years old, you know, right, swastika, right, he I sits mean, there and makes fucking makes uh, uh, scorpions uh, out of people. Operation hair. Charles Manson could All right, exist listen, somehow. Listen, we got Bonnie in DC. I got two really good calls here. Operation First one is Bonnie. <laughs> Bonnie in DC, go ahead. Hey, how come when the other guy Cash has called in and said Charles Manson doesn't even speak a lot of English, has made a legitimate point, and this other dude Anthony, his answer was prove it, and that was it. Will you prove something? You see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. It, it is, Anthony. You don't have any, you're not, you know, it's hard to say. I mean, I've heard some things that make sense. A oh. friend of mine told me why they have you bend down when planes crash and put your head between your knees. Yeah, yeah. It's so your neck cracks so you won't suffer. You know, it makes sense. But he's like, hey, I got some information. I'm yeah. like, well, where where you get that yeah, from? Because your friend told you it's it's gospel? Right, it's, it's hard um, to... The only reason why... I, I'd have the balls to call up and even like and 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 comment on that and say that is because well, is my buddy who works in the military. He does the whole uh, you know the whole eavesdropping thing, like the whole like uh, I'll put it like this. I, 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 <laughs> so he heard. Oh man, the military picked the wrong guy to eavesdrop. <laughs> yeah, this guy was going to tell everybody that he's the eavesdropper. Ooh, girl, you hear what happened? Right. Yeah. No, I'm just going to make a, a quick point, and, and then I'll punch out, though. Uh, hold on. You can't. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Before you make your quick point, uh, C. Wedge in Massachusetts, and then we'll end with you making your point. Go ahead, C. Wedge. Hey, what's up, guys? Hey. Hey. Um, yeah, I met, I met some of this whole Charles Manson thing actually uh, was going to happen, and it, and it went down like it did on Team America where they, you know, stuck shit on his face. <laughs> and, uh, you know, Dirk, Dirk and Muhammad Jihad happens just like that. Yeah, a lot of people commenting that this sounds a lot like <laughs> Team, Team America. America. Yeah. Yeah. Team America. Yeah, very good, C. Wedge. All right, your point, Thanks. Anthony. Uh, I'll put it like this. But this guy, and the only reason why I would think it's credible is because what this guy does, he does intel. Like, I can't say everything what, he, what you know, he does. Oh, he does already intel. This is so dangerous, though, to, 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 to do what you're doing, though, Anthony. I think you should stop. Because at some point, somebody's going to look for you and say, who's this? Who's your friend? Oh, they're, already look, oh, they're already looking for me. I'm ready. I'm ready. I got a whole battle of guns. I'll be ready to go in the mountains if, if the shit pops off. Oh, I'm paranoid because I know they're looking for me. They ain't going to get me, though. I know, I'm not, and, I and, and you're not, and you, all of this, and you you pay fourteen ninety five a month for serious rate, like, you, you're fucking, you have enough collected that make you, you just listen to morning radio every morning just to chill out. <laughs> Guns yeah. ready to die and fucking Sirius XM, motherfucker. That's your new, that's the new commercial. <laughs> I'm ready to die and Sirius XM. While the, while the government's burning down your house, you'll have classic <laughs> rewind at least to listen to. <laughs> I'm saying, I'm look. Charles Manson is what fucked him up. But if he had to say there's opera, there, I, I can see All it's right. possible yeah. to me. Yeah, I mean, he believes this shit. To us every day when, when we right. don't think it. All these high tech phones, and iPhones, four, and all this stuff. Yeah. If you punch in the right word, if you punch in the right word, it doesn't mean it doesn't matter if you're on your internet. It doesn't matter if if you're on your cell phone. Yeah. If you punch in a keyword, a flag comes up, and what they do is. 
It doesn't matter where, what base or where they at, but your IP address comes up, and they pull your IP address on your phone or your internet. So, I, so, so, you, so don't, Anthony, you don't sound crazy to me, Anthony. Like, Anthony I got, I got, name. I got my iPhone up right now. Okay, right. But the people that want to do go, harm to us, hold on. The people that want to do harm to us will Anthony, would speak in code. They wouldn't just fucking uh, make it that blatant. Yeah, they would. They would. I don't fucking know they wouldn't. Yes, they would. If, okay, if you if, if no. you text a friend, I can't stand Obama. Okay, that's one thing. If you text a friend, I can't stand Obama. I hope he gets gets blown up in his meeting uh, at Massachusetts as soon as he lands at the airport. If you but that's if you so you like, wouldn't. But you just uh, wouldn't do uh, that. I, gonna, I just dude, dude, you just I believe it. I just oh, dude, 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 wait. If, if, you I know what he's gonna say. It. Listen, to this. You, you just, just said it. So you now you're just flagged. said it. You're flagged, right? You you just flagged that's yourself. That's why I'm pushing it. I'm not gonna go fucking hide somewhere. Uh, all right, you just said it. <laughs> they got your IP well, put, right now. Now they got your shit. Yeah, yeah, they got me. Hey, but they, he just yeah, ruined his whole life. Yeah, but he's not worried about that. it. He's ready to kill everybody. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Cool. As he listens to fucking Asia. Jesus <laughs> Christ, man. That guy is batshit crazy. Batshit crazy with this fucking... I don't think so. <sighs> Come on. Yeah, Charles but a, ba a batshit crazy guy explained to me why bread is bad. Like, a, a homeless guy is just screaming why bread is bad. Yeah, and I go, this, is, this makes a lot of sense. Or a crazy man, I've heard, the only person I've ever heard to, to make space travel make sense. Like the the how do how do you space travel quickly? You know what's the, the science of it? It it is was crazy people. It's not like like Dr. Kaku when he called. He's a nut. Like yeah. he's not a a a regular dude, man. He's insane. But, but, but it's, he's it's, not it's, saying his friend no, like his whole on, story. He, do you think a guy Charles that is Manson's in military kind of, you know, intelligence? There's a swastika you, in the middle of his forehead. I know, but Operation Charles kind of, Manson is could be. On, I'm just on, saying. On, kind of stands without out. him. Hold on. Some young fucking. Let Anthony you wrap know, this thing do up. Do you think this Logically. fucking guy <laughs> has a friend in intelligence <laughs> that knows him? Now he knows him well enough because he's his friend. He's like, hey, my buddy Anthony. You know the loudmouth <laughs> motherfucker Anthony that babbles all kinds of shit. I'm in military intelligence to the point where I know all kinds of shit that they're doing. Well, let me, let me tell my dopey friend Anthony that fucking blabs it out to everybody. I absolutely agree with you. Okay, oh. and here's. Here's the thing I'll add. Mm -hmm. I think a friend told me when you're dealing with a guy like this, yeah, it is that his friend is him, and I think he might be oh, if he's if this he's is fucking has the, Tyler Durden shit. Yeah, if he has the ideas, I mean, if he's <laughs> saying that he has guns and he's waiting oh. for this shit, he's you know he might be listening to certain things, and then you elaborate. Cause I, I, you know, you, you when you're right. crazy, you, you do crazy things. Sometimes I catch myself daydreaming, like we were talking about, yeah, about things, and it becomes very real a daydream, and you make it make sense, and you make it fucking yeah, in yeah, your head. You but make it work. I think he doesn't have a friend, and uh. and you know.